drug test. I messed up, he came back and gave me a chance Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kana J and I'm back with a video video to say as you can tell by the title We are going to be prepping for school, this is gonna be part one because this is more so like requirements and stuff I gotta get done. Part two will be like my hair and supply shopping and stuff like that. So let me tell y'all the stuff I gotta get done. I need to read the handbook. The handbook is gonna have information on stuff that's required of us, rules for us, attendance. Also it's gonna have information about our clinicals, what we can wear, how we can have our nails. How we shave our hair, how we shave our socks, all that good stuff, jewelry, makeup, all that good stuff. Yeah, I need to read that handbook just so that I know because if you violate anything in there, you can get in trouble. And I don't, you know, like want to be irresponsible because I didn't read when they told us to read. So also, I need to get my student ID. I need to do CPR training and I need to order Castle Branch. Castle Branch has our background check and our drug test instructions on it. So I need to order that. That that costs real money, real paper, real paper. But yeah, so I gotta order that today. And then that's pretty much it. Today specifically, all I'm going to be doing is ordering Castle Branch and seeing what that's about. So CPR training is tomorrow at like three. So we'll be going to that. I need to take back this to five and below hard mount. This was the second one I got from five and below. I do not recommend getting these from five and below. I don't know what it is, but they have not been working out for me. The first one I got, I believe I got it off Amazon. I think I'm just gonna have to reorder that one. Hello, Hello. Hello. Hi. I have a return. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna do an exchange. Oh, y'all, I love these. Like, should I get this bag of candy or would I be wrong? Good, good. I think I know what I want. Okay. You know, five below with the graphic. I just got this t shirt. Mommy. Y'all, I gotta do an exchange, girl. A dollar fifty for this. Girl, pose, girl. Pose, girl. Up there. <laughs> but I'm about to do my castle branch. But I just want to show y'all the t-shirt I got. I really want more graphic tees and more headbands. If I get a lot of colorful head, different type of headbands, different type of graphic tees, I could do a little <laughs> some some like this is one of my favorite graphic tees, one of my only graphic tees. But as you see. The T match the headband, which is real cute. We are about to get our background check and drug testing set up. Currently at home doing some studying. I actually made an appointment for my drug test for tomorrow. So I have to get that done tomorrow, but we are going to CPR training today. I don't start till three, it's like 1.30 right now. I've just been doing laundry and sitting here and reviewing some stuff. Right now, I am reviewing the, the endocrine system. I have all the different types of lens. That's why I highly recommend this book, the ATIT's book, because not only will it prepare you for your T's, but it's actually like a very good book that'll just help you throughout your whole career, I feel like, because everything in it is just very helpful.
before she started. Yeah, so everybody get your payment out. I was like, what? In my head, everybody start pulling out money. I was just sitting there like, what? I was like, um, do you take cards? She was like, no. But you know, there's a gas station right around the corner, but gas stations be charging. So I just came up to the CVS. The CVS was only like a minute away with no traffic. We don't literally I'm like, oh my gosh, nursing school is expensive. So if you gotta get CPR training, if you can't find no free CPR training, don't go up in there think you about to get free training. And then I went back to look at the flyer. Y'all did not read the whole flyer. For some odd reason, I thought my school was just gonna provide CPR training for us. Cause it said our CPR um, dates. Oh yeah, cool. School providing CPR. Get there. CPR costs an arm and a leg. Okay, what else do you want from me? They already took my body this week. Took my head, my nerves, and everything else. But it's cool though. Thank God I had it. Like I said, I messed up, he came back and gave me a chance I'm living this life, gotta watch out for sin I'm trapping in music to save all my fans I know she want love, but I can't be a man And I told her I'm good, we can only be friends Hey, came a long way with this fate Bubble on me here like a drink Nowadays I can move saints Told him I only can pray for Got insurance on me like I'm staying So, I'm at work right now <clears throat> So, I think I'm just about to take her to an appointment and that's probably all and then i'll probably be leaving my drug test is not until two o'clock so yeah i gotta go to print off the paper for the drug test then go do the drug test today i know how you caught up in the past i know i get caught up in the past The pineapple passion fruit lemonade. Pineapple passion lemonade. You want the frozen or the Frozen. Alright. And a large um, ice water. And can I just have um, more ice than water? That's good. Got my ID. Y'all can't really see my face like that. But that's my ID. It says we changed lives. That lighting in there was so horrible. It was horrible on this camera. It was horrible on that camera. Because, like, I just look cold. Like, I just look super. Like, my teeth are not this color. My teeth are white. And on there, my teeth is yellow. So, it's just giving false identification. Like, is this really me? Is this really her? That's what it's giving because it's not giving me. This Kana J. My middle name is Joyce. And um my last name is Jefferson. So Kana J are my initials, but that's not my name. And that's kind of why I like Kana J. Like that's literally my initial. And then I just was like, okay, let me spell out my initial J-A-Y. And you got a little, you got a little, you got a little Mwaj Way Hey you all, so it is the next day. Your girl is dolled up or whatever. The last thing I have to do today is do the modules and read the handbook. Let me show y'all my outfits real cute. Top one that I'm actually just that I actually just opened today. Um it just came in my stuff from Sheen, so it's really cute. I paired it with these leather shorts and um this bag. And these shoes, and I threw on this wig because it matched the shirt. And yeah, I just really think this is a real cute looking look. And yeah, but I'm about to go ahead and film my haul.
looking tired. Um, I done put on my PJs because I'm about to call it a nine. Girl, I'm about to take this hair off, take this makeup off, and yeah, I'm about to go to bed. So, I finished all my modules and everything. I really wanted to let you guys know when you're feeling stressed to cast all your anxiousness and worries to the Lord because he would definitely provide you with peace as he says he would because this stuff I've been going through for the past couple days, it's been a lot. I've been feeling overwhelmed, but I have to just remember that the Lord takes care of everything and he has me in his palm rocking me just like this. So I don't have to worry. And I just wanted to insert that scripture for anyone else. Um, so you don't worry neither. Yeah, I just wanted to insert that verse um, to let you guys know that whenever you're stressed, anxious about anything, to go ahead and give it to the one who can solve them. Because you stressing ain't going to do nothing but make you die quicker. <laughs> I'm just playing, but no. Actually, science says that the more stress you have, you're most likely to get an illness in like the next year or something. I don't know. I learned that in psychology, but whatever. But yeah, just cast all your worries and your anxieties to the Lord. And he will take care of you. Because I was in my car just thinking about all the stuff I had to get done. Like, oh my gosh, I gotta get this done. I gotta get this done. Because, I mean, everything is due at a deadline. And if it's not right, it's like you're not getting into your program. After all this hard work. So it's just like I need everything to be right. And a couple things were just not right. And I'm just like, you know what? I know it's going to get handled because I serve a mighty God. And of course it got handled. Of course it did. Of course it Of course it is. <laughs> and you guys, um, I'm about to go to bed and call it a night. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Stay tuned for my next. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And see you all on the flip side. Bye.